Today I'm going to install the 817 Escort by Portable Zero onto my Yaesu FT818ND radio. As I said in my last video, this radio is nearly optimized for man-packable QRP operations, but it's not perfect. Uh, the good news is there's a, a pretty good aftermarket so that you can tailor the radio exactly to what you need. Uh, one of the things that I want to overcome with this is uh, these dials are, are kind of vulnerable if you put this down into a pouch or into a box that's not entirely secure because it's screwed in. So these radio rails stick up beyond uh, the dials and protect them a little bit. Plus they give a uh, little, little extra space to attach things uh, like the auto tuner. These are the basic pieces that come with it. The radio is upside down here, and these are the side rails that attach there, and then this is the stand that attaches to the side rails so you can elevate the face of the radio for when you're using it. To install it, you just take out the four screws on each side and use the Allen wrench bolts that come with it. Now that the stand is installed, you can see that it protects the knobs from being bumped if the radio is inside of a pouch or something like that. But it's also flared out on the edges, uh, so you can easily get to the, the dials. And you can also reach in this way. One other thing I like about it is this power button is a little bit hard to push. Sometimes you have to use two hands. Uh, but with this, you can just hook your finger through and you can push the power button and turn the radio on and off that way as well. So now we're going to install the stand. It flips it up and comes with a nylon washer to make it a nice smooth uh, rotation. The stand flops down and then flops back up. Then you put in the bolt, the nylon washer, and then the stand. A steel washer and then the nut. Portable Zero also sells this uh, spider attachment. It's just uh, some shock cord with some little plastic cord locks and a triglide here, uh, and that holds the antenna tuner on there. And then it's just got a cord lock adjuster in the back so you can adjust the tightness. Uh, and since the antenna tuner has little rubber feet underneath, it holds it, holds it in place pretty well. <laughs> 